Hey guys, some of you might be wondering why OSX doesn't come with a basic paint application and Microsoft comes with MS Paint which is really useful if you want to like crop an image or edit an image really quickly, you don't want any Photoshop or have to pay for that or whatever. So I have found a really good free basic tool, it is called Paintbrush. So once you open it, it tells you to pick your resolution, so you just pick it or you type it in yourself, you press OK and it will stretch it out. And you have this basic toolbar here. So you get the basic tools, you've got your brush, and also you have stroke, which is the size of the brush, so I can put it all the way up to 10, or have it all the way at 1. You also have your basic rubber or eraser. You've got a selection tool, where you can select the part and then move it. You've got the basic spray paint. You've got the filler. You've got this bomb which erases everything and you've got just standard lines and you've got free form lines where you draw a line and then you can change the line by clicking and dragging on it you have your shapes your different shapes you've got text which is and this text tool is really good because you can type in whatever text you want then you can change the font from here so I can just pick maybe like LCD and maybe like 72 and press place and you can place it wherever you want you can do the color picker tool so you pick a color that's on there and it will change the color to that and obviously you've got the zooming tool then you can go back here and change it to whatever you want and if you want to change the color you just click on this black bit here and there's many ways of changing the color you can if I put this back up you can use this color picker like this and change the opacity and change the darkness or well, over here you can use a gray scale slider you can choose it from a list and you can make different palettes you can choose it from a color spectrum and you can just pick from different crayons so if I just pick this flora then get my paintbrush it works really well so then you can just go file save and save the image as a PNG, a JPEG, a GIF, a BMP, or a TIFF. So then, you can also open images, and you can open any image. So I've just got, say so I've got this image here. I can open it up, and say I just want to like crop this out. I just select it, then press FN and backspace, and it's gone. And you can basically edit the image. So that's it.